Hi, welcome to Sunil Math Tutorial Vector Calculus. In this class, we solve some problems. So, the first one prove that div r bar is equal to 3, curl r bar is equal to 0, div of r bar cross a bar is equal to 0, and so on. To solve this problem, let us take small r bar is equal to xi bar plus yj bar plus zk bar. And a bar is equals to a bar is equals to a1 i bar plus a2 j bar plus a3 k bar. Dive r bar. Now the first one dive r bar is equals to del dot r bar del dot r bar. This is nothing but i bar dot i bar dot do r bar by do x plus j bar dot do r bar by do y plus k bar dot do r bar by do z. You observe that r bar is equal to x i bar plus y z bar plus z k bar. So which gives i bar dot do r bar by do x means you get only i bar, i bar dot i bar. Do r bar by do y means you get z bar z bar dot z bar plus k bar dot k bar. We know that dot product definition i bar dot i bar z bar dot z bar k bar dot k bar is equal to 1. 1 plus 1 plus 1 which is equal to 3. Therefore, di bar bar is equal to 3. Di bar bar is equal to 3. Let us find curl r bar. The second one curl r bar which is equal to mod i bar, j bar, k bar, do by do x, do by do y, do by do z. R bar coefficients, x, y, z. x, y, z. Expand the determinant, i bar into, you observe that, do by do y of z, 0, do by do z of y, 0. Similarly, minus z bar into, after removing the row and column where z bar, z bar lies, do by do x of z, 0, do by do z of x, 0. So, plus k bar into 0 also. So, finally you get 0. Therefore, curl r bar is equal to 0. Dive r bar is equal to 3. Curl r bar is equal to 0. And the next third one, divergence of r bar cross a bar. Divergence of R bar cross A bar. Let us find first R bar cross A bar. Now, R bar cross A bar is equals to mod I bar, J bar, K bar, coefficients of R bar, X, Y, Z, coefficients of A bar, A1, A2, A3. Expand this determinant. I bar I bar into a3 y minus a2 z minus z bar into a3 x minus a1 z plus k bar into a2 x minus a1 y. Let us find divergence of r bar cross a bar. Divergence of r bar cross a bar del dot r bar cross a bar this is nothing but i bar dot do by do x of r bar do by do x of r bar cross a bar so let us write the second definition here second definition here Let it be some f bar, say, do f1 by do x plus do f2 by do y plus do f3 by do z. You observe that this is f bar means f1 i bar plus f2 j bar plus f3 k bar, where f1 is equals to a3 y minus a2 z, f2 is equals to minus a3 minus of a3x minus a1z and f3 is equals to 
a to x minus a one. Whenever you compare with this term with f bar, this is in the form of f one i bar, f two z bar, f three k bar. So you get f one a three y minus a two z, f two minus of a three x minus a one z, f three a two x minus a one y. You observe that do f one by do x. F one does not contains x. F one does not contains x. Do f two by do y. F two does not contain y. Do f three by do z. F three does not contain z. This shows us. This shows us. This derivative do by do x of constant. Do by do y of constant. Do by do z of constant. So it trivially zero. Every term is zero. Trivially zero. Therefore, therefore. Divergence of r bar cross a bar is equals to zero. Let us find the curl. Next, curl r bar cross a bar. Mod i bar j bar k bar. First row two by two x two by two y. Do by do z, f one, f two, f three, f one, f two, f three. Substitute all the terms, which is equal to mod i bar, j bar, k bar. Do by do x, do by do y, do by do z, f one, a three y minus A two z, F two, A one z minus A three x, A one z minus A three x, F three, A two x minus A one y. Differentiate this term with respect to y, respect to the variables x y z. I bar into, I bar into, two by two y of you get minus A one, minus A one, two by two z of again you get minus A one. Minus z bar into two by two x of a two plus a two plus k bar into a k bar into two by two z of two by two x of minus a three minus a three. So finally you get minus two a one i bar minus two a two j bar minus two a three k bar. By making minus two common a one i bar. Plus a two j bar plus a three k bar. This is nothing but this is nothing but minus two a bar. Therefore, curl of r bar cross a bar is equals to minus two a bar. Observe that. Observe that. And the last step you have to find gradient of r bar dot a bar. Gradient of r bar dot a bar. First, we find r bar dot a bar. Now calculate r bar dot a bar. X one i bar, sorry, x i bar plus y j bar plus z k bar dot a one i bar plus a two j bar plus a three k bar. This gives a result of a one x plus a two y. Plus a three z. It is very trivial because it is a dot product. I bar dot I bar, j bar dot j bar, k bar dot k bar one. Remaining dot product becomes zero. Let it be some phi. Now, grad r bar dot a bar is equal to grad phi. Grad phi is equal to I bar into two phi by two x plus j bar into two phi by two y. Plus k bar into two phi by two z. It is very very simple. Phi a one x plus a two y plus a three z. Two phi by two x. You get a one. I bar into a one plus z bar into a two plus k bar into a three. This is nothing but a one i bar plus a two j bar plus a three k bar, which is equals to a bar. Therefore, grad. R bar dot A bar is equal to small A bar, which is required. Right? Let us solve the next problem. 
show that the vector function next problem show that the vector function uh, f bar is equals to 3 y power 4 z square i bar plus 4 x cube z square j bar minus 3 x square y square k bar is solenoidal. Show that the vector function f bar is solenoidal. In the previous classes we learned about the definition of divergence. If div f bar is equals to 0, if div f bar is equals to 0, then we say that the function f bar is solenoidal. So, solution given that given that f bar is equals to 3 y power 4 z square i bar plus 4 x cube z square j bar minus 3 x square y square k bar. This is nothing but f1 i bar plus f2 j bar plus f3 k bar. Come on, where f1 is equals to 3 y power 4 z square f2 is equals to 4 x cube z square f3 is equals to minus 3 x square y square. Now calculate the derivatives do f1 by do x. Do by do x of 3 y power 4 z square. You observe that derivative with respect to x, derivative with respect to x, this term does not contain in x, which treated as a constant term. So, derivative of constant term is 0. Next, do f2 by do y, which is equals to do by do y of 4 x cube z square again 0, do f3 by do z which is equals to do by do z of minus 3x square y square, which is equals to 0. Now, div f bar formula. Div f bar is equals to do f1 by do x plus do f2 by do y plus do f3 by do z, which is equals to 0. Therefore, div f bar is equals to 0, which implies as f bar is solenoidal. By the definition of solenoidal function, if divergence of a vector function is 0, if the divergence of a vector function is 0, then we say that the function is solenoidal. Then we say that the function is solenoidal. Right. Next problem. If f bar is equals to If the vector function f bar is equals to if the vector function f bar is equals to x plus 3y i bar x plus 3y i bar plus y minus 2z z bar plus x plus pz k bar x plus pz k bar is solenoidal is solenoidal then find p then find the value of p observe that given that f bar is equals to given that f bar is equals to x plus 3y into i bar plus y minus 2z into j bar plus x plus pz into k bar it is nothing but f1 i bar plus f2 j bar plus f3 k bar you observe that what is f1 here? f1 is x plus 3y. f1 x plus 3y. f2 y minus 2z. f3 x plus pz. x plus pz. And 
let us find the partial derivatives with respect to variables x, y, z. Do f1 by do x. Do f1 by do x. Do by do x of x plus 3y, you get 1. Do f2 by do y. Do by do y of y minus 2z, again you get 1. Do f3 by do z. Do by do z of x plus pz, you get the point p. Divergence of do f bar, do f1 by do x plus do f2 by do y plus do f3 by do z. Divergence of f bar, div f bar is equals to do f1 by do x plus do f2 by do y plus do f3 by do z. 1 plus 1 plus p. 1 plus 1 plus p. By given data, you get this is nothing but 2 plus p. 2 plus p. Given that, given that f bar is solenoidal, which implies div f bar is equals to 0, which implies 2 plus p is equals to 0. This shows as p is minus 2. Very, very important problem for 5 marks. Observe that. If f bar is solenoidal, then find p. If f bar is solenoidal, then find p. Observe that. Next problem. Prove that the vector function. Prove that the vector function. F bar is equals to sin y plus z into i bar. Sin y plus z into i bar. Plus x cos y minus z into j bar. x cos y minus z into j bar. Plus x minus y into k bar is irrotational. is irrotational. We know that a vector function is said to be irrotational if the curl of the function is 0. If the curl of the function is 0. You observe that. If curl of that function is 0, then we say that the function is then we say that the function is irrotational. Irrotational. So find curl f bar. If it is 0, then it is irrotational. So, given that the vector point function f bar is equals to, given f bar is equals to sin y plus, this is not if, show that, show that. f bar is equals to sin y plus z into i bar plus x cos y minus z into j bar plus x minus y into k bar. This is nothing but f1 i bar plus f2 j bar plus f3 k bar where f1 is equals to sin y plus z, f2 is equals to x cos y minus z, f3 is equals to x minus y. Curl f bar is equals to mod i bar j bar k bar. What is the formula? Dou by dou x, dou by dou y. Do by do z, which is e uh, f1, f2, f3, which is equals to mod i bar, j bar, k bar, do by do x, do by do y, do by do z, f1, sin y plus z, f2, x cos y minus z, f3 x minus y. Expand the determinant. Expand the determinant. i bar into do by do y of x minus y. Do by do y of x minus y you get minus 1. Do by do z of x x cos y minus z you get plus 1. Minus j bar into do by do x of x minus y again you get 1. Do by do z of sin y plus z again you get minus 1. Then plus k bar into do by do x of x cos y, you get cos y, k bar into cos y. Do by do y of sin y plus z minus cos y, cos y minus cos y, 0. Every term gets 0, minus 1 plus 1, 0, 0 and so on. So curl f bar is equals to 0. This shows us 
F bar is irrotational. This shows as F bar is irrotational vector. Observe that. So, by using these problems, solve some another problems. Practice the following problems. Try to solve the following problems. First one. Find L comma M comma N so that so that the vector capital F bar is equals to 2x plus 3y plus Lz into I bar plus mx plus 2y plus 3z into j bar plus 2x plus ny plus 3z into k bar is irrotational. F bar is irrotational. This F bar is irrotational means curl F bar is equal to 0. Show that curl F bar is equal to 0, automatically you find the values of L M N. In the previous problem, we find the value of P by using dive, dive F bar is equal to 0. Similar method, you work out that. The next problem, prove that, prove that the vector function, prove that the vector function, capital F bar is equal to y cube z square i bar minus 3x square z power 5 j bar minus 15x power 5 y power 4 k bar is a solenoidal vector is a solenoidal vector is a solenoidal vector solenoidal means Dive F bar is equal to 0. Solenoidal means dive F bar is equal to 0. And the next one, if pi is equal to, if pi is equal to 2x cube y square z power 4, then find divergent of, then find divergent of grad 5. So, please observe that divergent of grad 5 means first you have to find grad 5. First you have to find grad 5. What is formula for grad 5? i bar into dou 5 by dou x plus j bar into dou 5 by dou y plus k bar into dou 5 by dou z. Dou 5 by dou z. Let it be f bar. Let it be f bar. Grad 5 becomes f bar. If grad 5 becomes f bar, this problem becomes dive f bar. Simple. Both the formulas you know. Try to solve these three problems. Keep learning.